Hello, my name is Swiss Bianco. In this video we will have a look at the latest Opt 2 knives that I did make. It's a Swiss Bianco design. Basically a one purpose tool as I call it. It's a basically a dagger like shape of a knife. It's only sharpened on one side on most of the, the models but uh, it can be easily sharpened on the upper edge too. So this style of a knife is ultra light. That means we have a metal part and a G10 part. The G10 part we have in different colors. I did even make uh, one piece in uh, pink main color is black and olive green and uh, the sand color. So we have a 3 mm thick G10 side laminated together with about 1.5 mm stainless steel, in this case 440C. This lamination is pretty durable and so far we never had problems with it. It's basically the same as the license made Timberline Neck Angel uses. This knife is a serial made knife in uh, China according to my design and know-how. And uh, this of course as it is made in China it's cheaper than the, the handmade versions that we talk about here. The one purpose tool too. There was a one proposed tool number one that had basically no upper switch. The standard switch did go all the way up. That knife I did develop in Switzerland as I did uh, live in, in Switzerland and the law was against double edged weapons and uh, knives like this. So, so now I'm in USA for a good while. And uh, here in Georgia we have absolute no law against dagger like items. About the weight of this knife, I'm gonna put it on. The typical weight of this knife is 60 gram. Of course because it's handmade there will be always a little bit of difference but uh, that one is 60 gram, the knife itself. The sheet together with a mini tech lock, I will show you that later, has the, the weight of 106 grams. So it's still really, really light. I quick grab one in a sheet without the tech lock for, say, for neck carry, you can use it on a on a chain or a cord around your neck that is 83 grams. So you see for a knife in this size it's pretty uh, pretty uh, light. The length of it gonna show you that too. The length of it is 19.5 centimeters you have a good size handle, it's, it's a 100mm long uh, handle. The, the cutting edge is about 87mm. So you have a good size knife, my hands are relative big. So basically you hold it here and the thumb goes on the serrations. That gives you a good leverage and a good uh, grip. So the, the sheet of the one proposed tool is made out of Kydex, different colors. And on the back side we can mount the mini tech lock or the bigger one. That is that one here. The standard tech lock is uh, really nice, you can mount that on both sides if you want to have it for left side carry no problem. The sheet has all the needed holes. That's in my opinion really important that you not only have lashing points and uh, 
rivets that, that uh, hold the, the sheet together but you also have the hole so you can mount any size of tech lock as you want and this basically standard with the, the belt coming uh, through like this or you can reverse it and uh, put the belt through like that. So you are pretty flexible and this of course on this side uh, two for left side carry. So you are pretty flexible to, to carry the knife how you, you want it, how you need it and that, that is a big uh, goal for me. So the, the knife is relative thin and uh, this is the, the minimum thickness. If you wanna have a bit more a grip on it you can always wrap it with paracord. I offer this style of wrapping too. The thickness is not that much thicker but it gives you way more aggressive uh, grip to, to hold the, the knife. It's easy done. It's easy uh, replaced if you go outdoors and you would like to have it in orange or in any other color. In case it gets dirty you just uh, unwrap it and uh, put a put a new uh, wrap on it. So that's the video about the uh, one proposed tool to the Opt2 design and handmade by Swiss Bianco in USA.